नमस्ते एंड वेलकम टू डे ट्वेंटी ऑफ थर्टी डेज ऑफ एप राइट इन द लास्ट एपिसोड वी लुक एट द एप राइट स्टोरेज ए पी आई एंड इट्स डिफरेंट फंक्शनैलिटीज टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू यूज दैट ए पी आई इन एक्शन वी आर गोइंग टू अलाउ आवर यूजर्स टू एड दियर प्रोफाइल पिक्चर सो दैट we will be able to upload a picture using app rights storage api and then load and display the image for that i have already added image speaker dependency in my project and i have set up my profile page where i am loading the user and we will be saving the profile picture in users preferences once the profile picture is uploaded in the storage we will save the id in the users preferences so that next time we load the user we can get the file id from the preferences and load the file to display the profile image let us get started when we press the change picture button we want to upload a picture using app rights storage api first let's set up the storage api let's go to api service here Storage, storage, and let's initialize it. Okay, we now have storage initialized, and finally we can share future. multi part file file and then list string permission so we'll use the same permission for read and write here return storage dot create file file is file read is permission okay we now have a function to upload the file now let us use file picker to pick a file and upload let's create a function so here instead of this let's create a function called upload for the sake of simplicity i will implement the image speaker to get the image from gallery only but you can anyway implement it to get image from gallery or take a picture using camera so let us start first to upload the picture image speaker get image image source dot gallery if image null if image is not selected we can simply return otherwise we can use we can upload so first from file image dot path and finally we can upload using file and then permission will be user user dot id so future multi part ah okay i need to await this 
got the bracket here once we upload this we should return a response from here not this so here i can make and i can return data and make this return map string dynamic finally i should use try catch here says if res dollar id so if file is successfully saved and dollar id is returned we should save the id save the id to user preference so again in api service let us create another method called update preferences i don't think we have that here right get user sign up okay we don't have that here we can simply call account dot update preference and pass the preference let's await this and return res data so here we can call instance dot update preference so for the preference we will have an object photo will be our let's make this final id equals res dollar id and here let's check if not equal to null id so we should save this once this is complete we can call the get user again so that loaded preference will come and here we can show the picture for now i'll just say child text perhaps so that we can see the file id just to confirm that picture is uploaded and saved let me save this let's hot restart profile change picture allow let me upload a picture finally we can see the file id so this is how easily we can upload a picture to the AppRite storage. We can see the picture in the AppRite console. So if we go to the AppRite console, we can see our picture here and we can see the proper permission. We can view it. We can see the file ID. Now that we have uploaded the picture, we can use the preview endpoint in order to display the user's profile picture. So let's get back to that. In order to preview the picture, we should load the file and display the preview. So let me create a function here that will get the file. So future let's make it profile picture. Let's give it a file ID and this should return async underscore storage dot get file preview we can also pass width let's say we just want 
the picture of size 100 by 100 we want to display a small profile picture so we can crop it with width and height 100 by 100 we don't want parameters like background output and quality at the moment it's fine default is fine for rest and finally return response data and here I will use instead of this future builder circle avatar and here we need a future instance get profile picture and file id will be user perhaps photo background image should be memory image snapshot dot data and here we should check data not equal to null then this otherwise this should be null i should have a return type here this should be you int at list so this is what this should return and here i can say you int at list now if i save this should load the picture we can't see it properly so let's add radius 50 let's just wrap it with center now we can see our profile picture properly so we can use the preview endpoint to get preview for our image files we can pass in optional width and height parameter in order to crop the image in the size that we need and we can easily display the picture using either memory image when we need a image provider or image dot memory when we want to display image we can try to change the picture so let me upload another picture this should reset our profile picture this is how easy it is to upload and preview images similarly we could upload any image or any kind of files as well as let the users download the file using get file download instead of get file preview this is all for today's episode thank you everyone for watching this tutorial see you again in the next episode